fellow Africans in the United States of America. My name is Mad Madua Georgia. Africans have come a long way in this country. Starting from the days of slavery, the transatlantic slavery that brought millions of our ancestors here. And later, when we started migrating on our own, voluntary migration. The first was forced migration. We didn't want to be here. Our ancestors were forced down here on their back. America was built on their blood. The soil of America was watered. We who came at a later time came with our internet. We contributed to science and technology. We contributed to the economy of the United States. So we are no longer strangers in this land. Now we must take responsibility. We must take action because our lives matter. Even if some and insignificant few Americans who also were migrants, who fathers, forefathers were migrants to this country, but who think that they own America. America is a confluent country. People from various places came here. Now, in a day, the daytime, we'll be making a very important decision. America has suffered immense setback during the past four years under Donald J. Trump. I don't think America deserves to be under the strangle hand, stranglehold of this insensitive, insensible, irresponsible an irresponsible president who has crushed the image of America nearly beyond redemption. 200,000 Americans and more have died from COVID-19 due to the ineptitude of one man. One man who doesn't take advice from scientists. One man who does not believe in science. One man who does not believe that there is global warming, that things are getting out of control because it is driven by personal gains. America cannot, cannot afford another four years of Donald Trump. So I am calling all Africans who can vote, who have attained voting age. Come out and mass if you are not, if you have not already voted. So vote your heart. Vote your soul. Vote for everything but Donald Trump. Remember Donald Trump hates Africa and Africans, especially Nigerians. He hates us with passion. This is a time for us to pay him back. America is so divided now. We need a unifier. We need someone who can build economy. We need someone who can build bridges. We need someone with a human heart. We need someone who can look at you as a human being and not one who looks at you as someone who comes from a shithole continent, shithole Africa. So it is time for us to vote out a shithole president of the United States. Let us vote sensibility. Let us vote sensitivity. Let's vote responsibility. That is what we want. And that was what we should get. So if you are an African in the United States, sharpen your voter's card. Don't yield to intimidation. Don't yield to all the manipulation. Because they're going to roll out a lot of things. Let's go. Cast your vote. 
For those Africans at home who root for a hypocrite who does not know God, something is perhaps wrong with your head because you know nothing about Donald Trump to even build a movement and they're doing night vigil for him, for a man who hates your continent. And it's time to wake up, man. Africa, it's time. Wake up. God bless the United States of America.